Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell about irrational numbers. For example, 0.23 we can write as 23 by 100. This is a terminating decimal. 0.23 bar we can write as 0.2323 etc. So these type of numbers are non-terminating and repeating decimals because here this, this decimal part is not terminating and 2, 3 are repeating here. So these numbers are non-terminating and recurring or repeating decimals. If you observe these type of numbers 0 0.2020020002 etc. Here this decimal representation is non-terminating but here 0, 02 is repeating but between this 0, 02 and 0, 02 there is one zero and between these 0, 02 and this 0, 02 there are two zeros like this. So these numbers are called irrational numbers. So these are non-terminating, non-recurring decimals. So an irrational number we cannot write in the form p by q where q is not equal to 0. Some other examples of irrational numbers are root 2, root 3, root 5, root 17, root 15, pi, 0 0.01001001, etc. These are some of the properties of irrational numbers. First one, sum of two irrational numbers. If you take two irrational numbers like root 3 plus root 2, then we will get an irrational number. If you take root 5 and uh, minus root 5, if we add those two irrational numbers, then we get 0. So this is a rational number. So sum of two irrational numbers need not be an irrational number. Second one, difference of two irrational numbers. 5 root 6 minus 4 root 6 is equal to root 6. This is also an irrational number. If we take root 6 and root 6, if we subtract uh, from one number to another number, then we get 0. So this is a rational number. So difference also need not be a, an irrational number. Next one, product of two irrational numbers. Root 2 into root 3 is equal to root 6. This is an irrational number. Root 3 into root 3 is equal to root 9. This is equal to 3. This is a rational number. So, product of two irrational numbers need not be an irrational number. Next one, quotient. If you divide root 2 with root 3, then we will get an irrational number. And uh, if we divide root 8 with root 2, then root 8 by root 2 is equal to, we can write root 8 is equal to root 4 into root 2 by root 2. Cancel root 2, root 2, then root 4 is equal to 2. So this is a rational number. So quotient is also need not be an irrational number. Now please answer these questions. Find which are rational and which are irrational numbers. First one is root 17, root 225.27 bar pi. 3 root 5, 0 0.1, 0 0.1, 0 0.0, 0 0.0, 0 0, 0 0.0, etc. And here 0 0.0, 0 0.0, 0 0.0, 0 0.0, etc. Next question. Write two irrational numbers whose sum, difference, product, quotient are rational numbers. Third one. Write two irrational numbers whose sum, difference, product and quotient are irrational numbers.